Monday vlog. Monday vlog, what is happening my friends? I had a hilarious experience today, oh my. I climbed a mountain, <laughs> well, I walked up a big ass hill to film today's Monday vlog out in public. That was the goal, that was the dream, that was the mission. And I was starting to be confident vlogging. You know what this vlog needs, one sec. That's what this vlog needs. So I was out in the world, I was out in public, I was vlogging on a hilltop, beautiful setting, beautiful scenery, and I filmed the whole vlog with a fucking booger hanging out of my nose. So, all of that footage is not usable, but, I mean, I feel like I would be, I feel like it'd be rude to not share a bit of the bug footage with you, so... The premise for the vlog was I was taking Dollar Store Zilla. So the premise was, I had Dollar Store Zilla, I was gonna go on an adventure, I was gonna hang out in the park, I was gonna vlog in semi-public, parks are pretty private, but I was gonna hang out in a park and vlog, and then I came back home to edit, and would you know it, I had a bug hanging out of my nose. So if that isn't just like an interesting lesson in vlogging in public, for all of you out there, if you're vlogging, it could be so much worse. You could have a booger. Maybe before you turn the camera on, everyone needs to do a, a pre-film boog check and just do a once around in each nostril. But it was super funny uh, to come home to find that my time spent out into the world trying to vlog and make those minutes count was entirely wasted because I'm just a booger boy. So here's the booger footage. So I decided to take Dollar Store Zilla, you know, out into the world. Well, that was the booger footage. Uh, I don't really mind that my time was a little bit wasted. It was still nice to go up on a hilltop and hang out, but it's really funny that I was like, I'm gonna be confident and I'm gonna vlog in public and I'm gonna make an excellent vlog today. And it's like, mm, also you're an embarrassing booger boy. Try again, bud. So that's funny and embarrassing, but other than booger town, life's good. Videos have been going great. I'm glad you guys have been enjoying them. Thank you so much for watching them and commenting on them. I'm very happy, very pleased. Uh, but you know what else gets me stoked? You know what else gets me super jazzed? Uh, today is the day I get to replace the stupid giant fucking lights in my room. So I bitch about them like every second stream. Every second stream I bitch about these lights and how much space they take up in my room. Cause they're fucking humongous. And I finally got replacement lights. Boom! Here's one of them. The other one's actually set up and on me. I've already retired one of the giant lights, but I'm so happy. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh, just pull the bag open. What have we got? LED. Look at how tiny this thing is. This thing is so tiny. It's nothing compared to this fucking thing that I've had two of them up in my room for since I got them, since I started the fucking channel. So I'm replacing my giant softbox lights with these awesome LED panels. Holy shit, it's gonna change the game. It's gonna make your old pepper uh, a less cluttered pepper, that's for sure. You might be thinking those soft boxes are collapsible, Pepper. Why don't you just close them down? Because I film and edit two videos a week and stream once a week, so why would I take them down to only have to put them up constantly? So, super happy to retire them, replace them with something small and compact. Life is good, even though I'm a bugger boy. <laughs> Life is good, even though your old Pepper's a bit of a booger boy. So, thanks for hanging out, thanks for tuning in. New lights, new life, it's gonna be great. I'm pumped. And I now know when I vlog in public to, you know, pull out a little mirror, take a look up my nose and see if there's any bats in the cave. Cause I was a mad, mad dash booger boy. I will end this video with some footage of Dollar Store Zilla destroying the city. So, see you next time. Lego Advent time, guys. What's behind the next door? Door 11. Ooh, a snow guy. <laughs> yep, a snowman. I am not surprised, Lego. But, I'm not upset either. Alright, our snowman. There's not a ton to say about him. He's got a, a cheesy orange, orangey-yellow colored scarf. 
He's got a nacho cheese scarf. Uh, so we'll just set him on down in the city, right next to the other uh, other snow snowmen. Merry Christmas, everybody. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you tomorrow, and we'll keep the Christmas good times a-rolling. Maybe it's a sign that I should stop drinking when I spill beer in my room every fucking day. Oh, did that go in the USB port? Shit.